What's good with you guys? It's your boy and today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make guitar beats for someone like Kid Leroy. So as you can see by my screen, I already kind of started the sample. So first off, we have this VST called uh, Evolution Songwriter and we're using this 1976 preset. Um, so we have this simple chord progression going on inside of A sharp minor scale and the tempo is 164. When you're making these kind of beats, uh, make sure in the 140 to 170 BPM range. So yeah, uh, before I show you the melody, uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel, make sure you like this video and make sure you follow me on Instagram so you never miss an upload. And without any further ado, let's get straight to this. So I'm going to play this melody for you guys, but let me show you the effects first. We have Valhalla Vintage Verb which is this uh, spacious vocal preset and it's set to 11.6% uh, on the mix and for the EQ we just have this uh, low cut EQ at around 224 um, Hz and this is how the melody sounds So yeah, pretty fire melody. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to open up um, Omnisphere and add a sub bass below this and also some piano in the background. So let's open up Keyscape and use the standard grand piano and we can just follow the chords that we have over here. Okay, so we have this, let's randomize the velocity a lot. And also strum the notes. And let's add this to the mixer and lower the volume. And also throw in some effects. Alright, so now let's find a cool little belt to add on top of this to act like a counter melody or something like that. Let's copy the tour. And let's add that to the mixer track, but let's turn off some of the effects over here. Let's EQ out some of the frequencies first. Uh, let's show in some of the R reverb. And let's also add some delay as well. That's pretty much it for the melodies for now, let's uh, start with these drums. Yeah, let's start with this 808 pattern. So all we need to do is just follow these uh, bottom notes over here that are root notes. Just move this uh, two octaves up. And make sure your 808s are cut by itself. Okay, we already have a banger, I can already feel it. Now let's show in that kick. Just a standard red kick should work pretty fine. And let's copy that over as well, raise the velocity. In 
now let's do some rolls as well on the hi-hats, make them sound more interesting. So let's delete that second part and just add some um, pretty simple ro uh, rolls. So that's it for the drums. Now let's go back to the melodies and I'm gonna stack this uh, guitar with, with maybe like a pad or something like that from Omnisphere. Now let's add some effects to this uh, sort of bell or something like that. Yeah, let's also delete these notes. Let's just have the chords stacked. And maybe even throw in some uh, super massive. And the last thing that we're missing is sort of like a counter melody or something like that and I plan on doing that with some piano so let's close all of these omnispheres and just open this one and choose a piano from Keyscape. Let's use this maybe this rock one. Okay, so we have something going on here. I'm going to show you or what in a second. Let's just randomize the velocity first. So something interesting, but let's just uh, see if we can find a better preset for this. Okay, so this sounds pretty good. Let's add this to the mixer and all of these drums as well. And let's start with these effects. So first off, let me try something with secret sauce. That is pretty much it for this beat. If you guys did enjoy and I hope you guys like this beat, I'm gonna let you guys listen to this right now. So as I said in the beginning, make sure you follow me on Instagram, make sure you like this video and make sure you subscribe to my channel. And yeah, I'm gonna let you guys listen to the full beat now and I'm gonna catch you in the next one. Who can make the beat?